Right, experimental time again. Um, I've used all sorts of different things in the past for experimenting with the various tobaccos. But tonight, I've got tobacco which is a blend of three, which is Jermaine's Rich Dark Flake, Gareth Hogarth's Vulcan Mixture, and a dash of Kendall Dark, which is also Gareth Hogarth's. It's very, very, very nice actually. I just call it my, my own English mixture. It's really good, there's a good sweetness which I think comes from the the Germains. There's the Germains, it's a it's a dark flake. It's not as strong as your as your candle dark flake, not by a long chalk. But um the sweetness, it's got a a lovely sweetness which is a sort of a, a molasses sweetness that comes through. And the latakia of the in the latakia that's in the Balkan mixture sort of balances it very nicely. And the strength of the candle dark, which I've not used an awful lot of, just gives it a punch. It's really good. But it's um I'm not very precise with mixtures, but I'll say it was fifty percent well originally 50% of the Balkan, 50% of the Germains and then just throw in a dash of the maybe 10% of the um, of the Kendall Dark and it's really nice it's a really nice English mixture got a lot of character got a lot of depth a little bit of spiciness about it as well and the strength from the Kendall, Kendall Dark so it's one worth trying, give it a go sometime. And I'm smoking it in a Wilson's pipe. I'm not too sure about the heritage of Wilson's pipes. I know that uh, Wilson's used to make a lot of, well I think they do still make a lot of snuff. But um, I'm thinking it's coming from there, but it's a lovely briar, really nice. One that's had little use, that's uh, refurbed. But a good English pipe with a, a good English mix. Give it a try anyway. Just a few thoughts. Thanks for watching guys. Bye bye.